Yo, what's going on guys? You're watching Epic Pokemon TCG. Now, if you guys are noticing some black bars on the side, don't worry, I will get to that depending on what you're watching this video on. Uh, but today's video is kind of a test video. This video is basically uh, me asking you guys a really important question. Uh, basically, I, I just last night I was messing around on my iPad and I recorded a gameplay, which is the one you're seeing currently. And I just kind of wanted to pitch the idea to you guys of would you mind seeing gameplay coming from my iPad? Now, I actually uploaded a 30-second clip of this gameplay to YouTube. I unlisted it, looked at it myself, and the gameplay looked pretty clear for the most part. Uh, it's just the bars on the side. I don't know if I need to monkey with the settings in the uh, recording thing that I'm using or what it is. Uh, but yeah, basically, I'm just kind of asking you guys, since you're the ones taking time out of your day to, you know, watch my content and, you know, all that. If that was some, that would be something you guys would mind, it would only be the gameplays. I wouldn't be doing deck profiles like this. I'm still going to do that normally. Uh, but... Essentially, me doing this from my iPad is going to give me a chance to potentially get some more content out for you guys, because uh, that's something that I've been lacking, you know, the past couple months here with all the stuff going on. But, uh, you know, with the whole new like format and stuff, and the fact that I need to get me some new cards on Pokemon TCG Online, I thought it'd be a perfect opportunity for me to kind of, you know, just crank out some more content. You know, maybe I could do some type of thing where like I'll upload a deck profile and then I'll do like a tournament on Pokemon TCG online with the deck recorded from my iPad or something like that. Uh, but essentially this is just kind of like, you know, trying to get feedback from you guys. Now this gameplay I actually got last night was uh, pretty good. Uh, I got like a few of them and this was the best one that I got. So I went ahead and uh, transferred it over to my computer, which is actually some, which is really easy. Honestly, it's so easy to do. All I have to do is just plug my USB in plug it into my iPad, drag it over, we're good. Uh, I unfortunately do take the L in this gameplay uh, because my opponent like has a extremely, I mean extremely perfect reset stamp. I can't stress how just perfect it was. <laughs> anyway, a little spoiler alert there. Uh, but yeah, essentially I'm just kind of asking you guys like for some feedback. Is that something you would be interested in seeing? Now, if you guys don't even see the black bars, because I don't know what you guys are watching this on. I don't know if you guys are using a phone, a computer, whatever it might be. Uh, but whenever I watched it, I had it up on my PlayStation, the YouTube app on that, and I saw it. And then and whenever I full screened it on my computer, I would see it. Uh, I don't know like exactly if I just need the monkey with some settings or what I need to do there. But uh, it was something that like just kind of like caught my eye. And I talked to my friends about it, and they're like, dude, go for it. You know, you never know. Or just attempt it. Hell yeah, do it, man. Don't worry about it. Just upload it. You know, this would be a good way for you to get some content. And I also have a friend, uh, you know, offering to help me with gameplays so I can get in contact with my boy and just record some gameplays for you guys. You know, maybe uh, get some feedback from you guys, see what decks you want to see face off against each other, and we can make that happen. So, yeah, I've told you guys past few videos, I've been definitely trying to get some big things happening, and I already am getting some big things happening. I have deck profiles on the way, guys. I'm going to be trying to up the gameplay content. I'm going to be trying my best to make my channel better than it ever was. Uh, I know that for a while there, it was theme deck, 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 theme deck. <laughs> and while I love those videos, I can't express to you guys how much I love playing theme decks. That is like some of the most fun things to do in Pokemon for me is play the theme decks because it's so chill and you never know what could happen. And like sometimes really bad cards can shine in that. But I know that I should not focus my entire channel around it, especially whenever this huge horizon of just decks. I have my arms extended straight out. You guys can't see it, but just, you know, visualize a fat guy and a Spider-Man like tank top basketball jersey thing holding his arms out. I'm not going to get into Spider-Man because I think that whole thing is stupid right now. Jesus, both sides are being stupid. You can pick sides with that whole debate, but really in the end, it's just like both companies are just being stupid. They're missing. Like them not doing the deal, honestly, is costing themselves more money than just doing it. You know, it's like, well, like quit being stupid. Okay. That's, that's my take on it. I don't, I don't care who's right, who's wrong. I just want Spider-Man in the MCU. Okay. So that's all I want. Tom Holland is fantastic. I don't want to see him go off in Narnia land Spider-Man where they can't really acknowledge anything that happened in MC. Okay. All right. I, I promised I wouldn't go off on it. But anyway, back to what I was talking about. <laughs> see, now when Dylan starts ranting about things he finds completely ignorant, he just goes off. Anyway, so another thing I wanted to add in, it would pretty much just be the same exact thing you guys would be seeing for the most part. It just might be like more. Uh, the issue with my laptop is like my laptop isn't like a complete total pos but sometimes it can be uh pokemon tcg online will crash sometimes on me and it just i i honestly i need a new pc like that's 100 percent what needs to happen i need to get a new pc um yeah so 
it would be the same thing. It would just sometimes be live commentary, or it might be what you guys are seeing now, where I go back and throw my voice over it. But uh, with the iPad, you know, I can use my Astro, so you know, like that'll sound pretty good. I think um, I actually listened to that earlier. Uh, this actually already had commentary over it, but I thought that doing this would be better than the actual commentary itself just to kind of pitch this idea to you guys if it came out and was like full-on picture i might have just went ahead and kept the commentary um but honestly like i just wanted to get your feedback and you can be honest with me if this is not something you want to see and it's like a majority thing that i see in the comment section is like hey you know we don't want the black bar videos, you know, like no iPad videos, please, or something like that. As long as you're cool about it, you know, hey, I completely understand. I know that that's something that would probably be annoying to some people. Uh, if you don't see it, you know, then hey, that's awesome, fantastic. I'm going to try to monkey with the settings to see if I can't fix that or turn that off so this video might even turn out to be irrelevant. But, you know, uh, it's just like an idea that I had, you know, in my head, you know, maybe I can try to pitch out some more uh, Pokemon TCG online gameplay videos. And I'm working on trying to build my online collection up and just kind of seeing where I could go from there. Uh, really, like, you guys are the ones that watch these videos. You guys are the ones that are pretty much like my channel. Like, you guys are my channel. You watch the videos, you tune into them. Uh, you're why I try my best to crank out uh, content that I think would be watchable. Sometimes that doesn't necessarily happen, but yeah. So you guys might be noticing on screen, I have the stadium in my hand. I can get rid of that stadium that pretty much makes Dark Pokemon take one less prize, and he hits me with the reset stamp. I was so angry, I could not put it into words. I wouldn't say angry, more of annoyed, and I draw into absolute crap, and I just couldn't hit the card. And I got so close. That stadium really just like came in really clutch for my opponent. Now, he's playing like this really neat dark toolbox with like Sharpedo and stuff in it. It was pretty cool. But yeah, I... I figured, you know, if I can just kind of crank out some more content, you know, I make sure every single video I say, you know, hey, this is from my iPad, so we're going to see the black bars or whatever, then that'd be cool, you know, and it's just really going to be gameplay videos, and I already have, like, some ideas for what I can do, uh, mostly, like, tournament videos, I can do, like, some lengthy tournament videos, and uh, maybe I could even do, like, tournament videos, and then, like, we can uh, get together and, like, a call, like, my friends and I, and maybe we can do, like, some type of podcast type thing with that you know that would help out with it but yeah honestly guys like i'm trying my best to try to figure out like what i want to do as far as like content goes i have an idea but it's just like uh do i want to in implement the ipad gameplays and such like if you guys love these then i can definitely do more of them you know i just got to get on there and just get some cars and get some gameplays and go from there um yeah, so right now I have like two decks on Pokemon TCG Online. I have this one. I have um, a Malamar deck, and I'm going to build a Lost March deck, and I'm working on a couple others. Um, but for the most part, like I can definitely do some more gameplays for you guys. It's just more or less, are you cool with the iPad videos? That's like the main question of this entire thing. Uh, it'll be the same thing, just from an iPad. That's pretty much... And my iPad doesn't necessarily freeze. It doesn't freeze or nothing like that. It runs Pokemon TCG Online just fine. And the program that I use is super easy. So really, like, it would just be, it's, I don't know, man. It just seems like it would be a little more convenient for me to crank out, like, gameplays videos for you guys. Like, I'm still going to do the deck profiles on my computer and do all that normally. But, yeah, so I'm going to leave you guys with that question. Uh, as you can tell, uh, if, that, if I top deck the stadium right here coming into my turn, you know how happy I would have been? I would have been so happy. Oh, and this uh, this deck that you're seeing on screen is the one I just covered. That'll be at the end card of this video if you guys want to check out the list to it. But yeah, just a fun little deck that I threw together. And honestly, this was a really good game. I I, I may have lost, but it was a really good game. Uh, it just kind of came down to like an unfortunate reset stamp that he played down. But for the most part, I thought it was a good gameplay. But yeah, I want to say thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, take care. I do actually concede the game because he spent like 50 seconds moving all of his energy absolutely that he had on the field to a Sharpedo, so I just backed out of the game and went to the end screen so I could sign out the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know down in the comment section below if this is something you guys want to see from the iPad. Let me know. But thank you guys all so much. Take care. 1,050 damage. Not bad. Take care. I already said that. This is Rambling. Yeah, this is Rambling. Catch you later. This is that Pokemon TCG. Signing out.